leap into frigid water is just another day at the office for these divers. Neil Case, the division diving officer for the New York State Police underwater recovery team, invited us to one of their training exercises. Getting them out there, getting them under the ice, um, and they're being directed into a, a known target that we staged out here, which is, happens to be a jet ski. Oxygen bubbles indicate where the divers are under the thin ice of Lake George. The jet ski is about the size of a snowmobile, simulating a snowmobiler going through the ice. They're closing their eyes and they're trusting topside to direct them into that target. Those topside members direct the divers using technology called sector scan sonar. Mounted on a tripod under the water, the device offers a 360 degree view of a landscape that cannot be seen by the naked eye due to the murky conditions. Topside is actually directing the divers right into our target. Divers, we're going to need you to go 180 degrees from your umbilical. All they have to do is go left, go right, go straight until Topside puts them on through their target. State police don't just keep this knowledge to themselves, they share it with other agencies. Today, the NYPD scuba team is also here. The technology is being used in recent high-profile searches, like the one along the Mohawk River for missing Schenectady teen Samantha Humphrey. The team is typically brought in for recovery efforts. Every recovery that we make is emotionally difficult. But Case says being able to offer closure to a family underscores even more the meaning and purpose behind this kind of work. In Lake George, Anya Tucker, News 10 ABC.